In today's video, I'll be showing you how to transfer crypto from Binance to Coinbase. In order to transfer crypto from Binance to Coinbase, you must have both a Binance account and a Coinbase account set up. And once you've done that, we're now ready to start. So you want to start by heading over to Binance. And when you are logged in, you should be able to go into the top right corner and see this icon, which will take you down to your account wallet. Now, this process can be done on the website or the app, so it doesn't actually matter which device you're on. The process will be pretty similar. From here, we want to pick the coin in which we're trying to send. But in my case, I'm just going to send over AVAX. So you want to go up to where it says withdraw up here and we can click on that. And from here, we want to choose the coin which we're trying to send over to Coinbase. And as I said earlier, in my case, it's going to be AVAX. But yours might be different. From here, you want to get the address. So that means we're going to have to go over to Coinbase. And what we can do from here when we're logged in is we can go into the top right corner where it says send and receive. And we can click on that and then click on receive. Now from here, it's automatically set to Bitcoin. But since I'm trying to send over AVAX, I'm going to click on this. And I'm just going to type in the coin that I'm trying to send over here. So I'm going to type in AVAX. But if you want to send over Ethereum, you're obviously going to have to type in ETH. So when you found the coin that you want to receive inside of Coinbase, we can click on it. So from here, we can get the AVAX address to send to. And we can see down here that it says only send AVAX C chain to this address. So this is referring to the network. And it's important that you remember to do this because otherwise you may lose your funds. So we can copy the AVAX address here. Then we can go back to Binance. So we can get that wallet address that we just copied and we can paste it in here. And if you remember earlier, it said only send to AVAX C chain. So when we're choosing a network, we want to make sure we choose AVAX C chain, which is this one right here. And if we did send to these other networks, it would unfortunately be lost. So be sure to send it via the correct network. So now that we've selected that, we can choose how much we want to send. So let's just say I want to send 0.1. We can put that in here and then we can choose which wallet we want it to come out of. So as you can see, mine's in my spot wallet. So it doesn't matter whether I have funding wallet ticked or not. But if all your money was in the funding account, for example, you would want to make sure to tick funding account. From there, you want to review the transfer and make sure it's all correct. So we're sending AVAX on AVAX C chain to this address. So we can come back, make sure we are sending AVAX to AVAX C chain and you just want to double check that the address is correct. When we're happy with that, we can scroll down and we'll be able to withdraw. As you can see, it's not letting me because I don't actually have enough AVAX in my account. But as long as you are sending above the minimum amount and you do have it in your wallet, you will actually be able to click withdraw and send that over to Coinbase. Now, once it has sent, you can scroll down and you'll be able to see this recent withdrawal section. And after a few minutes, it should update in here and you should be able to see the transaction that you've made in this section here. From there, once it says that it's been confirmed, you can go back to your Coinbase account and in your balance, you should be able to see your assets. But as you can see, I only hold GBP at the moment. So that's how you can transfer crypto from Binance to Coinbase. If you found this video helpful, please comment down below to say this video helped you out. And also like and subscribe to see more content like this. If you're having any trouble transferring your crypto, feel free to leave a comment as well and I'll do my best to help you. Thanks for watching.